Well, I, I actually kind of thought it was like uh, when I first woke up, uh, it was uh, my alarm was going off like at 4.30 this morning, so I kind of didn't think much of it. I thought I was dreaming. I didn't oh. even remember. So I got the class teacher sat there and said something about it, and I was like, well, wait a minute, you know, is this really going on? Okay. Like, yeah, yeah. So. Okay. And did you feel any of the, like, aftershocks of it at all? Yes, I was over in the library, actually. Oh, really? Later. Yeah. I felt like somebody came up and pushed me, actually, kind of. I didn't know what was going on. I slept right through it. Didn't feel it. <laughs> when did you find out that an earthquake had happened? Um, when I woke up this morning at like 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock. And did somebody tell you or did you see it on the news? I know my roommate told me because she sleeps like really light. So she heard it, felt it all. I was asleep when the earthquake went and I thought someone was in the bathroom. Like, I don't know what was going on. Like, I was like, what is that? And my roommate was like, I need to go to the Oh, and I'm about to go now. <laughs> Oh, nice. So were you pretty surprised that there was an earthquake in the area, or were you just like, oh? Actually, um, I come by in, which is just two and a half hours south, and we're on a big fault line, so we have earthquake drills in our high school all the time. Oh, I woke up to the trembling this morning at about 4.30. Um, <laughs> my reaction was a bit different because my daughter actually slept with me last night, and I had already gotten up, and she was like, Mommy! Do you feel that? <laughs> and I'm like, yeah, I feel it. I think we're having an earthquake. And she was like, oh, in the Midwest? <laughs> so it, for me, I had gone through an earthquake before when I was in Las Vegas. So I knew what it felt like. Mm -hmm. Though it was extremely shocking that we would have one here in the Midwest, I think um, it didn't really um, dawn on me that, you know, we're having earthquakes until the second one at about, I think it was like 11.30 or so, and I was like, oh my god, that's another one, and all the stuff in the office is rumbling, I'm like, wow. <laughs> I got scared at that time. <laughs> all right. It's crazy. I've never felt anything like that before. Um, my house shook, and I woke up, I guess it was 5 or 6 this morning, and yeah. um, I thought it was a tornado at first. I've never been through a tornado either, but here in Illinois, that seems to be the more appropriate thing. And mm -hmm. my first reaction was to grab my dog and uh, those in the house and say, we needed to go to the basement until I was told it was an earthquake, at which point I ran down to see the news. I was up at 4.30 in the morning, but 4.38. Okay, so you were already awake, and like, did you automatically know it was an earthquake? I assumed it was, I knew the house was shaking at first, I thought it was hail yeah. and wind. And then I knew it was the math. I assumed it was the New Madrid fault. Okay. And did it like freak you out at all, or were you just kind of like, oh, earthquake? I was irritated about it. <laughs> that's, that's about it. Um, why did it make you irritated? Uh, when you're up at 4.38 in the morning, there's not a whole lot of things which will calm you down. I was sleeping, <laughs> and so my roommate told me about the first and second time I, I was sleeping. <laughs> so you had no idea it had happened at all? I didn't keep calling my phone telling me about it, but I didn't see what happened. I, uh, the house started to rattle. I could hear the windows rattling and, and the bed shaking. Oh, wow. And I imagine there were about 15 people outside of my house shaking it. Oh, wow. I kind of, that was what was going on in my dream. So I woke up and, and I didn't really know what was going on and I stood up and the floor was shaking and it, then it occurred to me it was probably an earthquake, but it was the first earthquake I've ever experienced, experienced that I was awake for or could feel. So Okay. And did you immediately grab like your kids or a dog or anything? I screamed and, like... for my husband. He just <laughs> happened to be upstairs because he's a, a night owl at about four in the morning, but he was upstairs surfing the internet or something like <laughs> that. And I, I screamed his name because then I thought maybe he was doing something that was causing it. And mm -hmm. he said, it's an earthquake. So. And what did you do when you found out that it was an earthquake? I went back to bed. <laughs> <laughs> well, it stopped, and then I just, you know, I was tired, so I just went back to bed.